Hey, what's up guys? Um, wasn't planning on even recording it all today. I know I've been a little bit slow on it recently. I've been dealing with shit. But, uh, so we're about done with my walks for today. And we're, uh, we're on our way back. We are at 4,000 something steps. 4,226, I think it said. But, instead of us just stopping at 5k today, we're gonna go ahead and walk around my neighborhood. And, uh, she has a couple of nice cars we out in this area. She has seen the older Mustang soft top. I've seen a Firebird, Camaro, some nice trucks. Uh, I've, seen, I've seen quite a few nice vehicles. So if I see anything on the way back, I'll let you know. Obviously, you guys are going to see it all anyway. Yeah, so um, two questions for you guys to put down in the comments if you guys feel like it. All right, so question one: What is your favorite car in the world? If you could have any car that was ever made, what well, what car would it be? Or motorcycle, because that's still a vehicle. So, um, second question. What is the coolest car you've ever actually seen? Like in real life, in person, not through video or anything. Coolest car I've seen. I'm not sure what exactly it was. It was a, Lam it's a Lamborghini. I can't remember exactly what it was because it was only for a couple seconds because it was on the opposite lane of the highway when I was going on, on a road trip down to Tennessee. And that's probably the coolest car. Mm. Either that or my teacher's Porsche. He has a 918 Cayman. And I see that almost every day that I have school school, almost every other day. It's a really nice looking car. But yeah, don't really got much to do, so figured. Guys, I was thinking about making this video about a week and a half ago. And then forgot. And then just started dealing with shit, so. Hey, look at that. I got my two miles in. Still any more steps, so. We're just about there. But yeah, probably the coolest thing I've seen would either have to be the Lamborghini I saw for only a couple seconds or my teacher's Porsche. cars up on this road but I don't really pay attention much up here so let's see anything I'll let you know and obviously show you this it through the trees but there's a pretty nice vehicle down there that we're gonna go be seeing here in just a minute right now i'm walking next to a moving truck 
That's why there's a lot of noise. I'm not sure if you guys can see it. There's a pretty nice Dodge Charger down there, newer. I don't think I've ever seen that. But we'll be going down that way in a minute. We got a couple things to do. We're, gonna, we're basically gonna stay on this road. It's a dead end, turns off. We actually just came from a dead end. But I don't think there's anything nice up here. We'll check it anyway. And then we're gonna take a left, go down the hill. And then another immediate left. That'll bring us over to where the Firebird and a couple of the trucks normally are. See if there's anything nice on that road as well. There's nothing really nice on my road, so I'm not going to bring you down there. Um, there's nothing really nice over on the road behind my house either, so I'm not going over there either. And a little Highlander. Some have a van. And a little Toyota Matrix. Okay, some have a Silverado. Not sure how well you guys can see anything on video though. So if it's hard to see stuff, that's my bad. There's nothing I can really do about that though. It's actually kind of nice out for once. It's still cold, but sun's out. We're just about 5,000 steps. I don't think you can see that on the camera either. We still have a little ways to go, not a whole ton, but this is going straight to my house. This will be the end of the video right about here. But like I said, I showed a couple of the nice air cars over in this area. And then we'll go ahead and uh, call it that. I know it's a pretty boring video, but I enjoy making them because then I have something to do other than just sit here. So normally I'll just be sitting here walking and listening to music or whatever. But this gives me something to do other than just sit here and listen to music. You know what, if I do get big at some point, just gonna sit here and look back at all these shitty little videos and laugh. I kind of know they're shit. They're shit to me now, but like I said, it's more for my enjoyment. And if you guys find enjoyment too cool,
more Chevys. That one's front plastic is falling off. <clears throat> Hope the fire bridge over here could be sick. If not, whatever. Sometimes they got parked up in their garage and shit, but I'm not gonna go over to their freaking garage to show you off their car. That's not my business. So. Thirty-three in the afternoon. And no, this is not pre-recorded. Some of them are, this one's not. Firebird somewhere outside of in the garage. But that's a nice little ram. I hear I like folks with that one. Yeah, the firebird somewhere else. Somebody's probably out driving and having fun with it. But that's fine. We're only going to go slightly on one road real quick because that's where the Mustang and a couple of other cars are. This guy seems to be like a hoarder or something. I know that's there because it's got snow all over it. And I don't know if it even runs or not, but... Stop every stop signs. Good.
there's the charger and there's the soft top mustang in the back it's got the truck in the middle so you can't really see it all that great but there's the front end you might be able to see it through the bushes a bit okay that's mustang you have another charger Yeah, that Malibu sounds terrible. Straight. I don't think there's anything else after we go up the hill. But we're gonna go straight anyway. So I want to save the camera for the last. Okay, so this is probably the nicest car we're in my area than that Firebird. Not sure where this bus is going. So I'm gonna drive across real quick. There we go. Yeah, they're going straight. Just be sure about it's moving from here in just a minute. Just the guy with the Camaro is a bit of a prick, so if he's outside, I might have to see if I can show him without getting too close because he's a real asshole. Just riding my bike over here shortly after I moved in, so three and a half years ago and he had just bought the Camaro apparently because he thought I was trying to steal it because I stopped on my bike to look at it. And he threatened me with a shotgun and shit without even knowing who I was just over the fact that I stopped to look at his car. Didn't even get off the bike or nothing. I was literally sitting there on my bike, stopped. Short kind of the Camaro. I don't know if he has a shotgun, but all I know is that I was not gonna stay around after he said he was gonna shoot me with a shotgun. Go forward and Subaru on the other wall behind it. Right there's the Subaru. I think I don't think there's much I missed. Hey, there's a couple of trucks that I could have walked by and shown, but there's a lot more walking for it only a couple of things. Which you would which we would already seen. There's different colors and shit. So I don't think there's anything like cool cool that I missed. <laughs> Up the hill. 
6,000 steps. Maybe 7,000 by the time I end this walk. Or end the video at least. My feet are killing me though. But that's fine. Because you deal with pain every once in a while. It's not like a lot of pain anyway. It's dealt with way worse. Shins but suck ass. Tell you that much, I used to run. So having shin splints is not something that's fun. Broke my arm. That was not fun. My sister's sitting there laughing her ass off at me when I broke it because I got shoved down at skate estate. Fucking asshole. I couldn't move my arm. My sister's sitting there laughing at me. We, I honestly thought it was a sprain though. There's a nice little, you don't know what that is to be honest with you. It's lifted. It's got street tires though. I don't know why you'd lift your truck and not have at least some decent off-roading tires on it, but to each their own. We have a RAV4. Dodge. All right, now we're gonna come up on some interesting stuff here in just a minute. Might record today too. I'm not sure yet. Well, a video. I mean, a game that is. I was in recording right now, so. My sister's friend actually lives in one of these houses, I'm not going to say which one, or used to live in one of these houses, I'm not sure which, but a Nissan 350Z. with a juke right behind it. Honda uh, Elantra. Kiss Rento. Where's that charger at? I think the charger's gone. I'm going to assume that the charger's over here with this Jeep and shit, but I don't even remember to be honest. I know it's over on the left side, but I'm not seeing it up ahead of me, so. Yeah, little Jeep Liberty, Saturn. Fisher is right behind that Saturn though. Chevy, Silverado. Oh, here's the charger. Oh, it's really nice looking though. I've never seen this out here before, so it must be relatively new or people moved in. Yeah, there's nice looking black uh, charger that we saw up top. In PA, not that well, not nowhere exactly in PA, but they got PA license plate, which is about 50 minutes south. If I go quiet over right here in a minute, it's gonna come up to the guy with the cameras and shit, and if he's outside, I'm gonna go quiet, so.
Yeah, I'm not sure how much you guys got to see of that. But I'll have to uh, come back through and show the, I'll show that off. Probably be on another one of the videos over that you're talking. Assuming he's not out here. Yeah, I'm going to leave this one off here. So, uh, stay frosty. And if you enjoy the videos, make sure to subscribe. If you don't enjoy them, don't subscribe. I mean, I'm not going to sit here and ask you to subscribe. So, if you enjoy them, please do. It will help. But, uh, and down in the comments, like I said, you want to know what your favorite car would be. I want to know what the coolest car you've seen could be. And if you have any song requests or any video requests at all, uh, go ahead and put them down in the comments. And I will see what I can do to do that, to complete those requests. Just remember though, M16, I don't have access to as much as most people. And even if I had my license, I couldn't really do a whole ton of car on the car. Right, anyways, I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace out.